I mean, there's so there's so many ways on, from a soccer's perspective that we have to improve on. You know, how do we fight for space on the field? How do we keep the ball longer in matches and have more control? How do we transition faster in both offense and defense? And you know, how do we guide the team towards where we want the ball to go and press together and create? traps and direct the ball. All these things are stuff that we want to improve on from last year. Um, but this is a natural progression. This is, you know, this is not something that's surprising or should be surprising. These are things that we're continually, next year I'll be sitting here saying the same things, that we want to get better at a list of things. I think last year we, um, you know, the coaching staff came in, we had a big squad, I didn't know anybody, so the only coaching method we had available to us at the time was to, for lack of a better term, microwave cook the team. Give them, you know, zap them with this information and that information and everybody knows that's no way to, you know, correctly coach a team. But that's all we had at our disposal. So from early on we were really excited about the prospect of having a spring semester to work with the guys. Um, so we have a smaller squad that returns. Um, a squad that's now been with our coaching staff for a whole year. So they know the expectations, they know the environment that they're coming into. Some of the guys last year were coming for Eckerd as a school, were maybe coming because of the previous coach. You know, now that everybody who returns, they're coming for our coaching staff, our style of soccer, our, um, you know, our philosophies and what we're trying to do. So, you know, there's not a massive class joining us, but just some key guys, some for the future, some will make an immediate impact. But I think the, the group and harmony of the team that we have right now they'll be able to bring them in quite seamlessly. Um, and we'll work with the seniors and upperclassmen to make sure that is a seamless pro, uh, process into our team. That's we open up on the road up at Young Harris and uh, North Georgia. Young Harris are a team that has a plethora of ex-players playing in the professional ranks. They do a very, very good job of attracting and, and uh, locating very good players and bringing them across here, quite an international-based team. So that's a team that year on year are at the top level of Division Two. Uh, so to play them will be, give us a very good grasp and preparation for the types of team that we play within our conference. North Georgia on that same weekend, again, a team we played last year, um, have a very strong team, physical team, very well organised, well coached, have some good individual qualities as well. Uh, we played a very tight game with them and again that will be a, a, great, a great learning curve and experience on the road to play these kind of higher level Division II programs. The reason I'm here, the reason most of the players are here, the reason the coaches and players and the other teams are here in this conference is because it's such a high level. You have, I don't think there's a single match in our conference where two team, uh, there's a team that will easily beat the other team. A every game could go either way. And then I think you've got about six or seven teams in a conference of 11 who have a very realistic chance of, of winning the conference. So. This is, this is great, this is what you want, uh, this is a great environment to play in and uh, we're really excited to, to year on year keep that level as high as possible. I want every team in the conference to come in with as good a record as possible because it can only do well for our teams and the, for the level of player that we can attract to our conference um, and that's important. The goals of the team are, are the same as they always will be and that's to each individual year for that team to find its own identity to, to not worry about the future or past teams and to, to create and have a clear focus on what they want to be as a group based on their individual qualities and for that group to become the best that they can be, to reach their individual potential. What that may be from year to year may differ, but this group that comes in needs to find a way to become the best that they can be um, as much as anything. is to really, really enjoy our soccer or football, sorry, the way I say it. but. Um, to enjoy that every day and to put a brand out there that, that we are proud of um, and, and an excitement that, you know, if I'm going to sit, go and sit and watch soccer games for the rest of my career, I want to enjoy them and, uh, and I think our team do as well. So that's a big focus of ourselves to, to, um, to pay our dues every day and to produce a, an exciting uh, brand of soccer for Eckerd College Soccer.